IGNU attached to the IPM course of Iron Indoor. As of now, IGNU is not attached to the IPM course of Iron Indoor. The IPM course offered by Iron Indoor is a five-year dual degree program in which the participants pursue a BA in Foundations of Management degree in the first three years and in the last two years they pursue an MBA degree along with the PGP participants. At the end of the five years, both these degrees are provided by IIM Indoor. Until 2018, the participants used to get a diploma degree at the end of three years, which was provided by IGNU. However, in 2018, the IIM Act was passed and now both the degrees are provided by IIM Indoor. So as of now, 2021, the IPM program of IIM Indoor is completely independent of IGNU. Once you reach your examination center, you go through a couple of checks before you enter the exam hall. Once you enter the exam hall, they will click your picture. Then you are seated down on your respective seats and you have to sign an attendance sheet. Next, they ask you to log into the exam portal on the computer, which they will guide you through. Once you're logged in, you wait for the exam to begin. You will be provided with ample rough sheets to work on. After the exam, you have to submit your admit card and rough sheets before exiting the examination hall. I'd recommend the following for the exam day. Keep at least two extra passport size photographs with you. Reach the examination center at least 30 minutes earlier and acclimatize yourself to the environment. This will make you much more confident while giving the exam. And finally, do not forget to carry a water bottle with you. I might have missed some intricate details, but you do not need to know everything. They will explain everything multiple times and in detail. So do not worry and do your best. Question is, do IPM students have the same faculty and placement opportunities as PGP students at IIMN? Well, the answer is yes, IPM students do have the same faculty and placement opportunities as PGP students. In your first three years at IPM, you'll be taught by professors who are simultaneously teaching PGP batches also. And in your fourth and fifth year, you'll be sitting with your uh, PGP batchmates in the same classroom. So, of course, you'll have the same faculty. Uh, regarding placement, uh, yes, you'll ha also have the same placement opportunities as PGP students. Uh, for your fourth year summer placement as well as your fifth year final placement, you will be governed by the placement committee, which handles the placements for both IPM as well as PGPs and you'll have the same opportunities and companies opening up for both of them. So yes, the opportunities are equal and I hope that answers your question. So what is the fifth? Is IPM really hectic? So, oh, let's wait a second guys. Yeah, so we are really watch so yeah for oh. let's see that's what it is stage. Now before we go into the interview, there are a few things that we need to keep note of. First off, let's discuss the kind of questions that you can expect to encounter. Broadly, there are four types. The first type of questions pertain to your awareness about general knowledge. Now these could be questions regarding, say, current affairs or other topics of relevance at that time. The second kind of questions pertain to your academics. Now these type of questions heavily depend upon which academic stream you're from. For example, I, being a student that hailed from the science stream, was asked questions regarding simple rotational physics and graphical calculus. The third type of questions that you can expect are questions that pertain to your interests. These, these questions are the perfect opportunity for the candidate to steer the conversation in the direction of his or her choosing. The fourth type of questions, and perhaps the most important, are miscellaneous questions. These questions test the candidate's general preparedness for the interview, uh, communicative abilities, and also seek to gauge the aspirant's motivations, views, and opinions regarding several topics uh, um, of relevance. These could be questions like, why IPM? If not IPM, then what? 
or even a question as simple as tell me more about yourself. I, during the course of my interview, was also asked to speak impromptu about a topic of the interviewers choosing given a certain amount of prep time. So those are also things that you need to expect when going in for the IPM interview. Now, as for the duration of the interview, the typical interview lasts anywhere between 20 to 35 minutes, but the actual amount of time may depend upon the individual candidate. Remember, the individual's motivation for joining the program is given, head, is given great importance while judging the candidate. So remember to be sincere. Now that's all from my side. Before going into the interview, keep calm, be confident of the answers you give while inside that room, and always remember to put on a smile for maximum impact. For more further queries regarding the interviews or general questions regarding the process itself, um, contact us at ipm.iimi. Until we meet next time. Bye-bye.